And I know it's still too warm to be thinking <laughs> snow and veil, but uh, we want to show you this beautiful picture. This is looking live from the Lion's Head Village web camera and beautiful fall colors out there. Ah, gorgeous. It's a nice fall evening, but Mike, some areas could see a few showers. Some showers and the higher mountains may see a couple of inches of snow this weekend. Mm, great. There you go. Nice stuff. I want to show you what's happening right now. Across the west, we have scattered showers and thunderstorms. Not very much, but they're out there and mostly over the mountains. But a few have been out on the plains, brought some gusty winds around from time to time. Rearrange your lawn furniture just a bit. This is a great looking shot from our camera that's up at Avon Beaver Creek and just some big puffy clouds up there and some beautiful fall color in the foreground. It's going to be a wonderful weekend to get up and see all the fall color, but you will want to take a little bit of rain gear. 73 at 7 p.m., a few isolated showers, 67 at 9 p.m., 60 by 11 p.m. Our top temp today was back in the 80s, 84 degrees, 57 was the low, 92 is the record. In 1892, 17 the record low in 1985, and the averages right now are down to 74 and 45 degrees. Currently, we have 83 at the airport and 82 downtown. The pressure's rising slightly. It's nice out there. Calm winds and 17% humidity with good air quality. Here's the map across the country. Ian, of course, off the coast of Florida. It is slowing down because it's interacting with this weather front, which is going to mean more really heavy rain for a lot of the Carolinas up into the Appalachian states. Here's our cold front that's approaching. As it comes in, we're getting a few showers in advance of it. Even by morning, we'll see some in northwest Colorado, mostly clear on the plains. Morning lows will be mainly in the 50s at lower elevations. Lyman, the dissenting vote at 47, 32 at Leadville, and we'll see readings in the 30s also at Kremlin and Walden by morning. Most of the rest of the mountains in the 40s. It'll be low to mid 50s on the plains, mainly clear. Isolated showers expected in the mountains. By midday, it's still mostly sunny on the plains, but here comes that front, and in the afternoon, there'll start to be some scattered showers and thunderstorms. The temperatures drop back a little bit tomorrow, upper 70s to around 80 degrees here, a little warmer out to the east ahead of that front, and just 50s in many of the mountain communities. Ahead of the front, it will be very warm over southeastern Colorado and cooler conditions back to the west. There's the front late in the day. That moves through. Saturday's cooler with scattered showers. Scattered, not all day rain, just scattered. Same story for Sunday and looking even into Monday, we'll have some scattered showers and storms around. So the seven day looks like this. 77 showers in the afternoon for tomorrow. Showers and cooler Saturday, 67. Chance of showers, maybe a couple of thunderstorms and 68 on Sunday. Monday's back to partly cloudy. There'll be some showers in the mountains. And then by Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, nice weather. Lows, upper 40s to around 50. Highs, low 70s.